Hello and welcome to the Listening Post's unboxing channel on YouTube. Today I'm unboxing a brand new arrival, the Duvla Silver Phantom. The Phantom uh, loudspeaker, um, media player, however you want to sort of put it, is, a, is an absolutely unique speaker system. Duvla has done a wonderful job, they've packed um, uh, excellent amplification, excellent media playback, app control, all of those types of things into a compact and beautiful looking speaker. They've reinforced that obviously with beautiful packaging. So let's pause for a moment and have a quick look. So if we look at this box, you'll see it's got pictorials, photographs, all sorts of things and the model information is just on one end. The packaging is probably second to none. Um, and beautiful as far as presenting such a, a, a lovely piece of electronics and audio art, really, into your home. Okay, so let's have a look. Now, um, model and serial information on one end, and two factory seals. We'll open one of them on this side and spin it around and open up the other one. And then the unit sort of folds open. Again, you know, giving you a beautiful sense of arrival. Um, the accessories in this box slide out and then the Phantom itself slides like this. Please hang around for some of the photographs. I'll um, take some close-ups of the packaging and other things so you can kind of see. Okay, so setting that aside for a moment, let's have a look at some of the accessories that the Duvla system comes with. And given the fact it's only got an optical and a network input, there's not going to be a lot in here, but let's have a look. We have got um, Duvillet's quick, uh, quick start guide. Um, basic information, plugging in, how to go to the app store, all of those things, and a little bit more information in some pamphlets. And pretty much that's it. We have got its power cord. Now, uh, this has a beautiful plug that actually nestles into the rear of the unit. Please again hang around for some photographs so you see how lovely that looks. There's a scallop in the bottom of the power cable enabling network and optical cables to pass through. And this is a unique power cable, a very yellow colour. Um, you could use a generic black or white one if required, but uh, Duvela like to mark the series of these between the standard Phantom, silver and gold, and with the colour of the power cord as well. There's nothing else in that accessory, so we'll just quietly get rid of it and concentrate on the unit itself. The model and serial number information is reinforced at the bottom of the unit and if I lift this up so you can have a look, again it's showing you lovely pictorials of the product and how it will look in, in sorry, how it looks inside, like a, an x-ray perhaps. It's sealed at both ends with some additional factory seal and it's a simple enough process to carefully nick that with a craft knife and start to open this product. Now, you can choose at this point to open just one end and open it like a clamshell or do what I'm doing, which is to roll it onto one side and then lift the packaging off. Okay. You'll see, and again I'll try and take some photographs, that the packaging is moulded specifically to the unit and it ensures that it will arrive to you in perfect condition. There is uh, additional protection at the base to ensure that the unit doesn't move around. And if I'm very, very careful, we can lift this unit out. It's worth mentioning, and again, we'll show you this in some photographs, that the radiators we're about to see are relatively delicate. Okay, so there's the inside, by the way. Um, right, so this is a beautiful silk sock. It's got elastic banding, and as I remove that, we get to see the product. Looking at the side of this unit, you will see uh, not only the, the, the base drivers, but also the indication as to what this model may be. In the gold Phantom, this main driver is white, with a gold inlay. In the standard Phantom, both are white. And in the silver, we've got a silver with silver inlay. Spinning it around and looking at the back for a moment, and I'm going to rock it forward. We have the main heat sink and the power button. Now, 
this uh, you can use a series of commands, uh, three taps will give you a, uh, a factory reset, um, and other of, um, button pushes or sequences enable you to go into part of its setup or identification of the product as far as its uh, pairing and other features depending on if you're using just one or two of these. Very carefully rocking it forward, I also want you to have a look at the rear sockets. So there's power and in here the optical and uh, network cable. We would recommend that you uh, use a network cable, however Duvillet do use um, network over power and also uh, dual band wireless. So you know they covered off all manner of communications if required but a network cable gives you a real sense of um, well an understanding that it's going to work. As soon as you see a network cable uh, indicate a light blink you know you've got a good network cable um, connection. At the base of the product as I carefully roll it around is the main foot and with that an insert which has a little uh, clip. This is actually a very solid part of its design and enables it to key into any number of uh, uh, Duvillet's accessories including their wall brackets, uh, speaker stands and trees. It's worth noting that these side drivers are exposed and as such relatively delicate. Be very careful when unboxing this product to ensure that you don't end up with fingernails or end up dropping or slipping it. It's very heavy, certainly for its size, and it does mean these are a little bit more prone to physical or accidental damage. The unit has Duvillet's iconic uh, emblem at the top, uh, mid-range and tweeter of course as well. So, there we have it. Duvillet Silver Phantom, unboxed here at the listening post in Christchurch, New Zealand. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more, subscribe to our channel. <laughs>